Now, I'm going to make this simple because I do everything simply. Now, in a relationship, or any relationship, it all depends on what you want or what you need out of this. Now, when you're with somebody, you don't care. If it's real, you don't care. If, it, if you're going to just be kicking it and doing all that, don't do nothing. Just kick it. But when you're in a relationship with somebody, and it's a real relationship, you do all it takes to make sure the relationship is fresh and it's new. Now, don't get me wrong. A lot of people make judgment real quick. When I was younger, it'd be like, she won't do that. I can't mess with her. I remember one time there was this young lady who I was trying to like or whatever. And she asked me, could I wait for her? She was not ready to do anything. Could 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 you wait? Just have a little patience with. Me. Now, me being the person I was at that period of time was like, hey, I'm gonna wait as long as I can. And I think I waited like five months. But within that five months, I did some other things with other people. And of course, me being the person I am. I told this person what I had done and ended the relationship. Not because I didn't like her or because she wouldn't do what I wanted her to do. It's because when you're a young person, you have no patience. Now, that's one story. I once went out with this person. Let's say, say her name was W. So I'm going out with W, but W would only do that. She would only do that. And I was still young at the time, and I had just pretty much experienced, you know, the whole full thing, you know, slapping it on, you know what I'm saying, doing what I gotta do, getting the groove on. I just experienced that. And I'm with W now, and W wouldn't do that. All she would do is, that's all she would do. So, me being young and stupid, I told my friend, I'm like, hey man, I'm trying to hit the skins, but all she want to do is get a mouthful. Not thinking at the time maybe the girl wanted to save her body I don't know but as a young person you tend to talk too much and when I told my friend who was messing with her cousin he told the cousin and then I couldn't even get that no more so when it comes to a relationship or any relationship or anybody in your relationships you do what feels best for you some people will only do that and save the other piece for later. Or some people will quickly give up the other piece and not do that. It's preference, baby girl. It's preference. If that's what you like doing, go ahead, do it. But if that's not what you want to do because you don't think that person is mature enough to ex understand what you act, then that's like the ultimate. I hate that to say it, but if you meet somebody who's quick to do that, you done did it everywhere. You don't want that. That's nasty. If you trying to hook up with somebody, the last thing you do is be the first person to jump down and suck neck. You don't just, that's the last thing you do. You want to hook up with somebody, you know, you got to work your way up to that. I think uh, I was with this one girl and we went somewhere and she says, well, you just kept pushing my head down that way. You know that? Well, I was young and stupid. I figured after the one would only do that and then I wanted to get some scans that, hey, well, maybe this one will want to do that. See, when it comes to relationships, it's about learning. You learn the person before you just do something with the person. And yes, life is funny like that. Some people may want certain actions done to them, and they may not want to do certain actions. I've heard women say, I ain't saying no dick, but I'm going to get my pussy in I've heard women say that. He finna have a mouthful of pussy, but I ain't talking no dick. There you have it. I don't know if I helped you at all, because I don't think I did. I don't think I helped you at all. But from a man's perspective, from an older man's perspective, put it like this. You're my daughter. I don't want you to do it, because the person you do it for might not respect it. I mean, they might not understand the sacrifice when you go do that. When you go there. Even when a man do that, there's a sacrifice that has to be made. And a lot of people don't think it's just sex. Well, it's a sacrifice. 
Well, you stick your head between somebody's legs. You even got you got to know that person. You have got to know that person. And if the relationship ain't working, you might want to try something new. If the person is worth keeping in any way, shape, or form, try your best to make sure you keep that person, regardless of what you got to do. You try anything, if it don't work, then that ain't the person for you. If that's all the person is asking for and you just got with the person, don't waste your time. And I'm going to tell these ladies a trick and all these mans out here that watch this video, don't hate me for telling the truth. Now, when I was young and free and I wanted certain things to go my way, shit, I'd do it. You know, but me, <laughs> I tell you, uh, I ain't going no farther than this. I will literally put my hand on my hand and handle it like that. I'm not putting my old grill all up in there. Come on, man. Come on, I mean, come on, girl. You, you, don't, you, don't, you don't go all the way down to the end. Until the end. Okay? But a lot of people wouldn't understand that. Brother, <laughs> And then after a brother do it, he expected to get done. Some people will do it just to get it done. So, when it comes to putting your mouth anywhere, or, or, or doing some shit like that, that's all preference. If it's been forced upon you, then the person ain't really worth your time. And if you're forcing it on somebody, they ain't gonna be there because you're forcing it on them. When things like that happen between two people, it's a mutual thing. I'm trying to make her happy. She's trying to make me happy. That's how I go down. It ain't one person wants it and the other don't. It has to be a mutual feeling. But people do what people do. And you've been tubed. Hopefully I helped. And if I didn't help, understand what I say. Some will do it just to get it done. And it don't mind. It don't matter. I mean, if I'm going to do it, it's just to get it done. I'm married now, so I don't have to do that. But, for some men, when they're not up to par, they'll do it. They will do that, so when they do the other thing, they ain't already won. They're halfway there. So, if you use it in a matter to please somebody, then you're doing it in the right fashion. But if you're doing it to get somebody, then you shouldn't be doing it. Make sense? If you're doing it to keep somebody, you shouldn't be doing it. See what I'm saying? Then it goes back to preference. See, when you're dealing with snakes, you're liable to get bit. And snaky people want to push your head down. So, like I said, girlfriend, baby girl, little sister, my daughter, don't do it. If you don't have to do it, you don't want to do it, don't do it. It's a feeling. If you feel like doing it, do it. If you don't feel like doing it, don't have somebody try to make you do it. Don't be doing it just to do it. You understand that part of it? I know you do. Don't forget to subscribe to The Real AIX because I know you want to. But think about it. What could be more realer than the truth? Who better to teach somebody young the truth but somebody older. If you do it, do it because it feels right and not because somebody making you feel like, oh, I gotta do this to keep him. Because if you gotta suck on some dick to keep somebody, he can keep on going to get his dick sucked where he been getting it sucked. Because I'm pretty sure after you don't do it, he gonna go right back to her and she will. Thank you, and you've been tubed.